Hi YouTube, this is Lisa for 40 Plus Buff and today I'm just going to talk a little bit about kind of the quick fix for your skin. As you age, or definitely as I age, I noticed that my pores started to get bigger and one of the things that you can do to remedy this is to add facials to your skin care. Okay, and this is something that I try to do at least once a month if I can do it once a week um, that's good for me as well because of my breakouts and they're pretty frequent but also the pores tend to get larger and larger um, as in between facials so I definitely try to kind of attack the pores before you know they just open up and swallow me whole after I do a facial one of the things I like to do on a more infrequent basis but I have to do it. It's a little bit more of a deep cleansing scrub. I can't use too many scrubs because in the past I found that they were just really abrasive. I mean they would leave little scratches all over my skin. So I'm pretty skeptical about anything that says scrubs but recently I did find the Sabina. This is a Smart Essentials daily detoxifying scrub. It is really smooth. You can feel it's a little bit granular but not in a heavy abrasive way and it does say that you can use it daily so I wouldn't recommend using it daily if you have my particular skin but this is something that I did the other day and it left a smooth finish it didn't break me out you know um, treated my skin to a little bit of a cleansing and this is what I ended up using the other thing I notice when I get up now is puffiness. So you don't really want to leave the house with puffy eyes. Yeah, I know we'll talk a little bit about eyes later with you know the dark circles and the puffiness, but one quick fix for that is witch hazel. Okay? And this works immediately. Like I saw the results. I woke up, my lids were a little puffy. I tend to rub my eyes, which you really shouldn't because it's all delicate. The skin is so delicate that you don't want to irritate it. But just put a little witch hazel on a pad, put it on my eyes, and I am good to go. And then I use a mild astringent, which is the witch hazel again, on my skin. And I try to do that daily, right after a wash. So, after washing, after the astringent, and maybe, you know, after I do a little bit more hardcore stuff with the facial and the scrub, um, one of the things I add nightly to my skin and first thing in the morning is a wrinkle treatment. So, I'm trying this because I'm out of my Pro-X, which is just awesome, awesome stuff. And... I'm doing this just because I'm wearing on top of my skin during the day uh, a really heavy sunscreen or just a, a higher SPF sunscreen. So underneath what I do is I put this Ultra Lift and I'm trying it. I, I just started using it. It's the daily targeted deep wrinkle treatment and this is by Garnier and they have a whole product line for anti-aging. So I am trying to get through um, a lot of things that I think are accessible to most people and I'm you know haven't seen like a huge huge difference but I did have some fine lines that were starting right in the corners of my eyes so I'm hitting those areas with this deep wrinkle treatment and you may ask like why are you using wrinkle cream well you want to use the wrinkle cream before you get the wrinkles by the time you get the wrinkles you're wrinkled so and then you have to do a whole another level of treatment so you know try to get to it before they get to you and this is something that I do in the areas that I think I'm going to wrinkle or that I see most women or most faces wrinkling and that's here in the creases of the forehead definitely these little laugh lines here in your eyes and you can see them and then around your mouth so this kind of concludes everything that I do on a regular basis just to kind of stay on top of my skin. These are my regular products that I'm using for the time being. Of course I'll introduce you to some other products that I think uh, I would like to test 
as well. So, and you can send me some ideas or your recommendations uh, for me to try things, and I will definitely do that. So, this is Lisa for 40 Plus Buff, just a quick skin essentials overview, and thanks for tuning in. Bye.